I want to salute you, homie, you know, for, for building your own thing and doing your own thing, creating your own platform, your own website. With my boy Alfred, I'm Mr. Talaferro.com. Mr. Right now, I'm about to go to Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> Just to see you with your logo on your mics. From you rock with Mr. Talaferro.com. Y'all go to Mr. Talaferro.com, it's going down. My biggest gift is my voice. It allows me to speak to the culture. Now, right now, you're turning up. On MrTalaferro.com, shawty. Yeah. All right, Alfred Talaferro, Mr. Talaferro TV. How y'all doing? Thank y'all for rocking with the kid. We get closing in on 25,000 subscribers. Thank y'all for the love. I'm trying my best to get there. We're about 16,500 right now. All right, Meek Mill, he disses Drake again. In a recent Funk Master Flex freestyle, Meek Mill said something to the effect of, like this. I'm not going to play the audio because Hot 97 will will try to take your channel down. It goes something like this. He says, um, stunning with this paper, feeling like baby. Posted up with Nikki. That's when they get tricky. Niggas in their feelings acting like Drizzy. They on their Drizzy. So that's another shot at Drizzy Drake. Why, Meek Mill? Why? It's over a year old. You got people claiming going for your life right now. You got the game on one side of the world saying he next time he see you, it's on site. You got Beanie Siegel pretty much saying you ain't allowed back in Philly. And you want to continue to take shots at Drake? I guess you can tie back to Drake going into Philadelphia during his Summer 16 tour. And pretty much going at Meek saying, look, you did this to yourself, performing back-to-back -back in your hometown of Philadelphia, and then walking out the arena, no harm, no foul, even though y'all thought y'all was going to get to a pop star, okay with that. But I'm just like, Meek, why are you going at Drizzy? Now, in the midst of the freestyle, to give me credit, he did throw a lot of subliminals at, at, I'm pretty sure, at Game and Beanie. One can imagine that those were two Game and Beanie. But he never said their name like he flatfoot said Drizzy. And another key element of this, think about this, all right? I'm going to bring two things up. Right before he says the Drizzy line, I, I told you it was posted up with Nikki. That's when they get iffy. Niggas, you know, in their feelings acting like Drizzy. Why does it feel like every time Nicki Minaj come up, he got to bring up Drake? That goes back to what Beanie Siegel said in the Tax Season podcast the other day. You can go check that out right now. He pretty much said, you looked over and asked your girl in bed, did you fuck that nigga? And she ain't give you the answer you wanted. And you have been hot ever since. It just feels like Meek Mill is that younger brother who's trying to live up to his older brother's standards. The older brother that went to Harvard, got the degree in four years, no problems, a successful accountant right now. The younger brother, he was never as smart as the older brother. I always had trouble in school, and he's been playing that catch-up game for the rest of his life. But the problem is, Meek Mill, you can't be Drake. That stop trying to play that game. You can't be Drake. That man is a pop star. Countless hits. You are a Philly rapper. A really good rapper. And by the way, let's not get this lost. In the mix of that Funk Master Flex freestyle, we forget that Meek can spit with the best of them. Let's make that clear. Meek can still spit with the best of them. Of them, but when you get caught up in this Drake, people just gonna be like, "Why? It's been a year, a year and some change since this beef has happened. Leave it alone." Then you already take that L and just go on with your life. Just go on with your life. You got other things to worry about right now. That's that. You look. That's just like Kevin Durant taking a shot. At Russell Westbrook in the Oklahoma City Thunder. It happened. Leave it alone. You got bigger, you got bigger fish to fry now. You own the to Kevin, you own the LeBron James and the Cleveland Cavaliers. You gotta worry about them right now. You can't be worrying about old news. It was big, it was it is what it is, what it happened, but it's old news, man. You gotta worry about the game who's on your ass in club saying when he see you it's on site you ready to put it on world star you got to worry about beanie siegel who in philly you got to go home sooner or later i just think his focus if he's gonna go with anybody and i'm not advocating going anybody i just keep it in the music make good music we cool with that we don't need these beeps because meek mill just don't make the right moves in these beefs that he's been partaking in over the last calendar year 
But that kid still get busy. He still get busy with. The, I'm saying kid like he like I'm not younger than him. But the the boy is nice with that pen though, and he's nice on them freestyles as well. All right. Talk to me in my comment box. What do you think about this blog and other blogs? All right, I go by the Maverick Telefell. You're currently tuning in to Miss Telefell TV. Meek Mill takes another shot at Drizzy Drake in a recent freestyle with Funk Master Flex. Salute, I'm out. Hey, first and foremost, I want to thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I would love if you watch other videos while you're on my YouTube channel. Now, while you're here, people ask me all the time, how can you support Mr. Telefero? Well, if you want to support me in my future endeavors, the first thing I want you to do is subscribe to my channel. If you subscribe to my channel, you get all my content first. Your subscribe goes a long way. I get to understand my demographics, understand who support me, who got something out this video. So first things first, a subscribe will go a long way. Next, if you really rock with me, donate a dollar to my GoFundMe. I have a GoFundMe link in the description. If you really want to support me, just a dollar. Showing me that a dollar and some good wishes will go a long way. If you want to support me and you want to help me with my travels, I got a lot of things coming up, but I got to get them travel fees there. I got to find a way to get there. So that can help me financially if you really want to go there. Also, a word of encouragement. Thank you, whatever it is. Talk to me in my comment box below. Comment on this video, like, subscribe, do whatever you got to do this video. I got to thank you for your time. I don't take it for granted. My name is Mr. Telefero. Now, if you subscribe, help, donate, do whatever, you can see more videos like this, more new exclusive content. I got a lot on the way. Trust me. Thank you. It's Mr. Telefero.com.